Hi! In this video we will see how we can create custom signals in Godot. Signals are very useful to send information between scenes just in certain conditions, and so we don't need to check these conditions at every frame. So, for this example, we will create these two scenes. The first one is just counting and sending a signal at every 5 points. And the second one receives the signal and shows a message. So, let's create a scene to send the signal. And here we will create a rich text and a timer to upgrade it. Now let's create our second scene. This scene will just listen to the signal and show a message. And now that we have our scenes created, let's add the signal. So first we need to create a signal in our first scene. And then we need to create a condition to emit the signal. And so, our signal will be fired every time this condition is true. But when a signal is emitted, it's not sent directly to another scene. It's just like the scene is saying, hey, I have a signal here. And so, if another scene is interested in this signal, it needs to be connected to it. And let's see how we can do that with our second scene. First, let's make our second scene be not visible. Then we can go back to our script and make the connection to the signal from the other scene. And now we can create the function that's called when the signal occurs. We can see that our signal is already working. But let's change our scripts a bit 
to make it look better. First, let's bring this part to the top. And now we can add a variable to be sent with our signal. And here we can change our logic a bit. And so we can send our points to the other scene. And now we can get the variable with the points here and make a custom message. Oh, and here we can change our logic to don't emit the signal when points are equal to zero. And then we create a yield function to wait a second and then put the visibility of this message to false again. And so we have our example finished, with signals being sent at every 5 seconds and the message being updated. And here, just for reference, are the codes for both our scenes. And this is it for this video, I hope you enjoyed it. If so, please consider give a thumbs up, subscribe, leave comments, and thanks for watching. Bye.